But the Mishcon Dere are fantastic in bringing different interests together, whether you've got the local authority, you've got the business sector, the voluntary sector. The importance of collaboration, where you've got members of both the public and the private sector sitting together in a room for two hours, debating some of the most important issues that face London, not just from a property perspective, but from a general perspective about how London is going to grow, how it's going to develop. And I think both the boroughs of outer London and the centre of London will benefit from that. It's really good to forward look the next decade, what are the challenges we're facing, but also the opportunities, and actually to talk amongst a peer group that perhaps isn't just the usual peer group that we're engaging with. Regeneration is a very hot topic at the moment, so really the question developers have to be asking themselves is what is regeneration? Because historically, local authorities would perhaps sell their land, monetize their property, and use the injection of capital funding to supply new housing. But now, local authorities are taking a much more collaborative approach in how they see their communities and areas developing. No single party can unlock the opportunities, and the public sector aren't building houses. It's the private sector that deliver that, but the private the sector can only do that where they have a license to operate and all the authorities with the various permissions in place. So it's absolutely critical that the public and private sector work together to deliver large scale projects in London. This is the opportunity to think afresh, to really start to tease out some new ideas, to build the trust that is so essential within that sort of collaborative approach that we need for our city making. Collaboration really is key to everything. I think we need more collaboration between central government and local government, more collaboration between the public sector and the private sector, and even, possibly, collaboration between the main political parties to sort out some of the issues. Where I'm seeing positive signs are where the public and the private sector are coming together to explain to the communities how things are built, how things are paid for, and bringing them into the conversation about what they want in their local area and helping achieve something that works for everybody. I think these debates are important because people who have some understanding of the issues of what's going on can meet other people who know more and actually if you talk with people you learn new things and knowledge moves on. That's why cities exist in the first place. I think with all the things that have occurred over the last year or two, London is at what we will look back as a key moment in its evolution. It's faced many problems over centuries. It's always faced up to them. It's always been very open in the way that it's taken on those challenges and it's always succeeded and come through. And I believe London will do it again.